Hey everyone, it's Fantasia and welcome back to another Sims 5 news video. So I did tell you guys if there's any news surrounding The Sims 5, even if we don't know if it's true or not, I'm going to cover it for you guys. So I decided to go ahead and make this video because Instant Gaming has changed the release date on their website. So they've had a Sims 5 listing up for a little while now. This is a new Sims 5 listing. They did have one previously that looked more fake. There's no photo because of course we don't have any pictures of the game yet. They decided to not use a placeholder photo. I personally personally prefer that, you know? And then like when we do get a picture of The Sims 5, they'll probably put it on here. So it says release date 2023. Obviously there's not going to be like a specific month yet, but I find it honestly really exciting that they changed it to 2023 because originally it was 2022 and I was like, you know, this listing does seem like more real than the previous one, but the 2022 release date was kind of making it a little weird because I was like, in my previous video, I was like, there's no way it's going to release. And then I was like, well, The Sims likes to surprise us sometimes, so maybe they'll drop it out of nowhere, but like the chances of that are very slim. There was just no freaking way they were going to release it in 2022 when we're literally at the end of the year. Like what? We're in October. October. There is no way. There would have been leaks by now and everything. So I think this is a really good sign. I feel like what's happening is, okay, first of all, if we're right about The Sims 5 potentially getting announced at the Sims Summit stream happening this month, which, oh my god, it's happening this month. Ah, if The Sims 5 gets announced, which, as we know, Jeff Grubb, who like predicts a lot of things in the gaming industry, I don't really know. He just, he's right about a lot of things. He predicted the Nintendo Direct and stuff like that. If he's right, Right about The Sims 5 being announced at that Sims Summit stream, then what I feel like is happening here is that the websites that sell The Sims are like getting more information and now they know it's going to be 2023. I don't know because like websites like this, they do get information. That's why leaks happen. That's why like instant gaming has like leaked things before that have ended up becoming true, you know? So like, I don't know, this gets me excited. I don't believe anything else has changed. I did read this out with you guys. I think it's pretty much the same. Yeah. If you guys notice any different differences with this let me know but as far as I can see this is the same little description that I already read out but yeah I just wanted to make this quick video talking about this what do you guys think like I said before I do think it's a good thing that you can't pre-order right now because then it kind of makes it seem like more of a scam when you can pre-order something that's not even officially announced yet but you can get notified by email on stock availability which is nice you know so yeah I feel like this video is really short but I just wanted to do this quick little news video what are you guys thinking are you guys excited for the sims stream. I'm so excited. Like even if they don't announce The Sims 5, I'm genuinely excited to see what they might announce because like apparently it's supposed to be something like that's, uh, I don't know, like it should be something exciting based on what they said. So even if it's like a very anticipated Sims 4 expansion pack, I won't be mad at that. Like The Sims 5 would be the ultimate thing to get announced that I would like lose my mind, but like I won't be mad if it's not that and it's something else exciting about The Sims 4. Like that's completely fine. Obviously, I still love The Sims 4. I just like, I'm ready to know when The Sims 5 could be coming. I'm just ready to have like information. I know it won't be coming soon. Like, I mean, if this is if this is right, if it's 2023, I'm going to take a guess it would be the end of 2023. Towards the end anyways. I mean, didn't The Sims 4 come out in like September? So it's like more towards the end of the year. Um, Then maybe they'll go on the same pattern for The Sims 5. I feel like that would actually make a lot of sense. So anyways, that's pretty much everything I wanted to talk about with you guys. Once that Sims Summit stream happens, I will definitely have news videos. No matter what the announcement is, I'll definitely have a video talking about it. But yeah, let's go ahead and do our notification shout out. And this one goes to Haley. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm glad you enjoyed the video and I'm glad we want like the same things for The Sims 5. <laughs> I did like a Sims 5 wishlist video um, if you guys didn't see that. But yeah, thank you so much for your comment. If you guys want a chance to be in a notification shadow, all you gotta do is comment down below. So with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day. And don't forget to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys also so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! The night is young, so let's have